Hello guys, what's up? My name is Yutrico and welcome to part 71 of my Minecraft Let's Play and today I'm going to show you guys what I've been working on for about a week and last time I asked people what they wanted me to build and I decided to go with the villager castle instead of a chicken castle or stuff like that so um, eventually I was thinking of making a zoo too so I'm going to do that but at the moment I don't think I can build everything that I want to build in the castle all at once it's going to be really hard, it took me forever to do the walls and even clear out the area so um here we go i'm going to show you guys basically what i built so this is like a little like a staircase you can get down easier um like from the sheet castle down to here um i do have like a ladder somewhere oh, over there but meh you could use this this is way cooler you can like look at it through there um through there okay and over here is the entrance. I wanted to make this iron doors because I didn't want, uh, if I made it wooden doors, it'd be really easy to just go in and out and villagers could go, could go in and out. But I don't really want um, like zombies and stuff breaking into here and killing absolutely everyone because that happens a lot. So I don't want to do that. Anyway, you just open the door just like that. And then uh, let's just show you guys around a bit. So this is the shop. You can buy stuff here, I guess. And this is all like, you know, role play or whatever, but here's all like items in the, the chest. I built all this in creative mode, by the way. There's no way I could do all this legit. I, uh, like when I was building, oh, when I was building my sheep castle, uh, I actually did that all legit, but I, I really did not fancy doing all this legit. So this is all done in creative mode, but um, the only reason for that is it'll just take forever for me to gather the materials. And I don't really think it makes a difference if I gather them first and then do it so it doesn't really make that much of a difference on my uh, gameplay or whatever so anyway so this is the guard tower you can well this is a guard tower here you can have some free chicken and just put it back because I don't want it to be full and here's like a little area you can craft stuff there's like some books and a jar of painting and if you go on the next floor there is like a sort of like a weapon thing there's like all uh wait did i just hear a noise i'm not sure what that was i swear i did anyway um here you're gonna have like uh like uh, i guess a chest with water in it for some reason <laughs> when you open a chest all the doors around it open too it's really weird but here you can have swords and arrows and uh bows and stuff and here's like a little seating area you can sit down i guess and up here, this is the, uh, the tallest bit. This is where you can look at the whole area and view everything around the area. I don't know if I'm this is on fire, I have it on normal. If I put it on fire, you can see really far, so that's really cool. Alright, so from up there too, you can go onto kind of like the, uh, the kind of like the walkway. I've never fallen on this before, it's like the first time. Here we go, right, so here you can go to a balcony, you can have a look around, and over here you can go, to, there's a house over there, and also go up here. So, that's pretty cool too, and you can, this is like a, this is the walkway around, you can go around the whole castle walls. So, from here, you can, oh wait, let's go to, well I guess we can use this over here to get to this house. So this, I want to make the house design a bit different, um, I guess it looks a bit different. This, I still don't know if I should keep this, but this basically turns on during the night and keeps light. It kind of looks ugly at the moment. I'm still working on it, but um, I don't know if I should keep this, but I might. So, this might not stay. Now, this is the house. I want to make it a bit different design than a normal house, so I kind of did. And, um, yeah, so, enter in here. Have some plant pots, have some chairs and a table. They're actually pistons, but... From here, you can. It's like a secret entrance to get outside. You can uh, just go outside, just like that. If you want to quickly escape, if there's like a raid or something, I don't know. You know, you just quickly go outside, and you're like, "Yeah, I'm free." So let's go back down. And this uh, this house is actually inhabited by villagers, but they usually go out during the day. They just like walk around the town and stuff in the village. And da 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 da. And there's like three guys on the bed um all right and <laughs> you have a like a i i put like chests around with like random stuff in it like stupid stuff that th that doesn't really matter so um here's like a little water up here 
you can um, you can get like upstairs or whatever. You could just go through the what's it called? Well, the roof. And from up here, you can well, I guess you can well go through here too. And then you can just climb down again if you wanted to. And then you're down here again by the by the entrance. So that's that house. Uh, I wanted to build this, which I thought was pretty pretty good idea. Like uh, you can just look outside. It, it kind of looks weird with the water. You can't really see through the water or whatever. But um, it's all right. It looks fine. So on the other side, it looks like this. I thought it looks pretty freaking cool. Um, so I wonder if you guys like it. I don't know. But I do. I think it looks freaking awesome. Uh, so yeah, and all these day, all these daylight sensors. I'll show you guys later what that does, but it's really cool. Here you can have like a little seat in there. You can like look at it like, whoa! Like this guy is like, oh, walls are awesome, yay! So now there's this. This is like the little playground. This is the first time that like I actually playing in the playground. I've never seen them do this before. But this is like a little thing you can keep going around circles and circles. This one stays in here forever, by the way. And this one can do two, the same, but it's not really filled with anybody. Um, I hope they don't fill this one, because this one I, I like to use myself. I'm like, yeah. oh, wait. I'm like, oh. I'm like, wait. Oh, my days, guys. The exciting something is happening. The night time. Now, what is this night time? Look. Look at this. This is a hotel, but look at the lights. Are you ready? It's getting night time and the daylight sensor should turn off. And when they do, the pistons are going to retract. The redstone blocks are going to activate the, uh, the redstone lamps. And they're going to turn on. So, this takes a little while sometimes. But the whole town, if you can look in the distance, you can see that too. It'll turn on too. And uh, just wait a little while. Just wait a little bit longer. Just gonna have to wait a little bit longer. A little bit longer. Come on. Oh my days, this is taking forever. Come on, it's night time. It should it should it should work. Hey. There we go. Whoa! See everyone's dancing. Yo guys, yeah! It's night time, all the lights are on. And that's exactly what this does too, it turns on all these lights. I know it looks a bit ugly with these, it, it looks like a chocolate cake or something with bananas on it, or whatever, but this looks freaking cool, I think it looks really cool, it lights up the whole area. And one there, and one there. I wanted to build a few more, there's one, I wanted to build one here, but we'll, we'll see really what, what what's going to happen with it, but we're going to see. So, here's like a little seating area, you can just view... Uh, like, this is a ball game, actually, I, you can't really play on your own, but let's pretend you have like, some slime balls. You're like, whoa, yeah. You want to kind of, this is really hard for me because I've changed the keys on my, on my, eh. You would play with one slime ball, and then, well, you would just, well, whoever has five points first wins. So, there we go, that's pretty fun. And there's a little swimming pool, you can be like, I like swimming, la 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 la. So, that's pretty cool. Here's another little viewing area. Now, up to, here is my hotel. This is the hotel, you can stay in luxury. It's freaking cool. I just actually got this guy to stay here, he actually kept walking away. Like before, there was a guy who kept walking away, but this guy's staying, he's like, I like this place. So, as you can see, there's all these keys, it, it doesn't really matter, but it's just for show, right? So, I have all these room keys. And uh, there's a, the exit door. I was going to make that iron door so he wouldn't escape, but he's not escaping, so it doesn't really matter. Um, up here, no villager actually stays up here. They always run away, but um, it doesn't really matter. So this is room one, room two, room three, room four, and room five. Now, room one is, as the room numbers go up, it's more expensive or whatever. It's, it has better stuff in it. So this one is just simple. We have a bed, we can sleep. Crafting table, chest, and a normal table for some reason. I don't know, and a torch, and a painting. So I'm gonna go to sleep for some reason. And there we go. Now, whenever I go to sleep, all the pistons and stuff retract again. So if you go outside, redstone, see? So the lights turn off, and I freaking love that. I love this automatic stuff that just automatically happens. It makes me feel happy. 
So, anyway, up here you can also go upstairs, I'll show that in a minute. This, w this one is a bit more expensive, only because you can have a turn on light, you can just turn it on and off, and it has a little painting of a, or an item thing, item frame of an iron sword. And you have a, pretty much the same as in room 1. And in here, you have more tables, you have the exact same as in room 2. Uh, two more paintings, or three paintings. And yeah, room 4 is pretty much a mirror, it's like the exact same, like if you look at this, and then you look at this, it's an exact mirror. It has the exact same paintings and everything. Um, well, I just realized that that's a big painting, but, and that that isn't, but I don't really care. This, this, this looks fine. So, that's that. And then here is room 5. Room 5 is the best room of the whole hotel. Um, it has a diamond sword thingy, item frame, really big table, seating area. I actually wanted to do this. I forgot about that, but don't worry about it, it's alright. So, you have a massive painting, you have a double bed, yeah, uh-huh. If I was here, I'd sleep right here. And then, well, yeah, so that's another bed. And then here, there you have a, a, like a pit, like a map, so you can see, kind of, where this is. So this is the hotel at the moment, and up here is, like, the, the playing field, and, you know, like, the rest of the, you see the castle outline, and here's, here I still need to build stuff. But, and then I was thinking of going around a lot, I don't know if I should fill this up, I could make this a really big castle, but uh, whatever. And I like the turns on and off. Now the best thing about this place, the room uh, 5, is that you can take a shower. So you can, if you're here, obviously because there's two beds, right, so if you're staying here with someone else, this is like a, like if you can hide behind them like, I'm gonna take a shower, Boop. and they can't see you, oh, I think I still see you, but you know. They won't look if they love you, right? So, whatever. Um, so you stand there, and you're like, I'm gonna take a shower, whoa! When you do a little dance, you do a bit of rapping, what you normally do in the shower. And then that's cool, that's all good. I actually, a villager actually was stuck in here once, but I had to get, take him out, because he didn't pay for his room, so. Anyway, so that's room 5, and that's about it, really, uh, for the hotel, except for upstairs. Upstairs, you have... Sort of like a, an area, you can look around, you're like, yo, everybody, woo, I still have to fill all this space. There's a random bit of redstone when I was practicing with the, with the, the daylight sensors, but you can just walk around all the way around here. I'm thinking of making it going around there and having, having some sort of a, like a, like having like a king or something, like my place where I live in this villager castle right there, like a big castle, and have me. That's where I live. I have like servants and stuff. Nah, I'm not gonna have servants. That's weird. Anyway, so yeah, and that's really about it, really. I don't know if my voice is going weird, but anyway, that's about it. And um, yeah, so that's all I've really built. I'm still planning on making a zoo. Someone said I should make a giraffe head, so I'm gonna make a giraffe head house. Uh, just because I want, like, I don't want to make like a place of town where all the houses are the same. That would be so boring. That would be so boring, so basically, that's all I really want to say, it would be so boring. So I want to make every house look different. I was going to make a wall house completely, and I was going to make a bank and stuff, so there's lots of stuff I still want to make. And I was going to make an entrance to the mushroom village, like over here, so you could enter, enter very quickly. So that would be really awesome. So if you, if one mind map does come available for download, I think around episode 100, then um, you can check all this out, and this is freaking awesome. So... Um, yeah, and the daylight sensors, I know it might look really cool and stuff, but I didn't think it up, actually, I actually watched a video on it, someone, I watched a video on how to make that, this thing, uh, this thing right here, and then I basically created my own version of it from here, so, if you guys do want a tutorial on that, I, c I don't really want to show it right now, because this is more of a let's play, but I can, I can do that, if you guys want me to, so I have like a thing that lights up. During the, during the night only, so it's freaking awesome. So thank you guys very much for watching. If you have any suggestions for the My Villager Castle, let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So thank you very much for watching, and bye bye.